Hello guys. This is your reading, you versus them, for the 10th through the 18th. This reading is for Capricorn. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Let's see. How did Capricorn see this person or view this relationship? How did they see this person? Okay. King of Wands. You were very attracted to them. You felt like they had it kind of going on. Um, they had their shit together. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Something about them made you feel like they were arrogant, but it was still attractive to you, though. <clears throat> How did this person view Capricorn in the relationship or the relationship? How did they view Capricorn? Very secretive, mysterious. They felt like you were very smart, though. Um, I think, <laughs> really, what this is, is this person, uh, yeah, they really feel like they have it going on. They still do. Um, but I feel like whatever charms they tried to, like, put on you, it worked enough. But you guys are still in con in control. Like, um, they didn't just win you over, hook, line, and sinker, initially. I feel like because I feel like you guys are very in tune and touch with yourselves and what it is that you want um, I feel like you you have the knowledge within you to discern uh, bullshit but yet still you know there was something very attractive about this person I feel like you you, you thought of them as being like non-threatening even though they come across as arrogant okay um, Piscean energy here <clears throat> What is going on with Capricorns right now? What's going on with Capricorns right now? Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. Yeah, there you are. <laughs> um, I feel like you guys are very grounded. You're very stable. Um, you ration your time well you ration your energy well okay um very attractive very like even if you're female you exhibit a lot of masculine energy a lot of masculine energy i feel um but still very very caring very um, loving but at the same time you don't wear your heart on your sleeve no no ma'am that's not what we do okay you show this person that you care but I think you mostly show this person you care by the time that you put into um, situations by the things that you do by the things that you buy um, like that you're more cerebral and you're more practical very much so Virgo energy there you're all about your home and taking care of the people around you as well I feel like some of you guys have Aries in your chart <clears throat> what's really going on for the other person Six of Swords. There's something that they're trying to work out in their mind. Um, they're really wanting to figure something out. How to get along with you. How to um, come to an agreement with you. Compromise with you is what I'm hearing. Aquarius energy. I feel like um, this, person's, this person is very proud. And it takes a lot for them to apologize. I'm feeling like an apology is is what somebody is wanting to make here. Um, they want to have a conversation with you. They want to talk to you. And they want you to listen. <clears throat> what is influencing Capricorn's situation currently? 
What's influencing Capricorn situation currently? Knight of Swords. You just want to make sure at the end of the day, um, whatever is going on in the exterior, outside of your home, outside of your circle, you want to you want to keep that shit outside. You don't want it to affect your your home life and and the people that you care about that you are responsible for. You put up this bubble around you. This person may have been trying to reach out to you, contact you, talk to you. Um, and I feel like that's why this bubble is up, this shield is up. Because for some reason I'm feeling them getting anxious. I'm feeling them um, trying it one way, the really subtle and cool way. Because they come across as cool and, and charming and, and collected. Um, but I think now they're getting anxious. And you can feel that anxiety. Because here you are as a high priestess, you can feel like the temperature changing in them. And so here you are, you're trying to keep like, um, like a fortress around you here. But this person is coming and they're coming fast and if they can't get in one way, they're going to try to get in another way. They're going to try to get a reaction out of you. I feel. But I feel like at the end of the day, you, you just want to make sure that nothing upsets your happy home. Your peace of mind. Some of you are currently involved in other situations where... Is strictly business is what I'm hearing from some of you it's strictly business like there is um, there's not much there other than the fact that you can count on something from this situation but that's it And this person, I feel like either they know about this for some of you and um, do not like what it is that they have found out. This person, I feel like they want to confront you about something here. Let's see what's influencing them. What's influencing them to be all calm and collected here? What's influencing them? The Eight of Cups. Because they were the one. They were the one that walked away. They got to fix it. They got to fix this shit. They want to come back. They want to come and have a conversation. But they know that getting through or... If they come with some bullshit, it's going to be easy for you to see right through it. So it's like they're strategizing, I feel, this person. They're strategizing. What's coming in for Capricorn? What's coming in for Capricorn? Queen of Wands. King of Wands there. guys like um, <laughs> meeting this person greeting this person with a smile on your face but you're still not with the bullshit though I don't know if I said this earlier in the reading but I feel like um, some of you guys have Aries in your chart but um, I see you meeting them with that same shit that they they come across with like yeah I mean I two can play that game basically I'm happy I'm good I don't need you what can I do for you <laughs> very business like like yeah I'm fine you 
Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You want to talk? Okay. <laughs> What's coming in for them? What's coming in for them? The devil. Oh, they lose their shit. Mm, they lose their shit. This person feels like they cannot live without you. Oh, they feel so very drawn to you. They feel like you are their person. You cannot go anywhere. You cannot be with anybody else. Mm. They almost feel like you've done something to them. They feel like you've done something to them. Because they don't usually act like this with people. They're usually the one who people act like this with. Oh, they're going to lose their shit because they are codependent on you. They are dependent on you. There's something in you that makes them feel so alive and so drawn. That is your card there, Capricorn. Let's see, what can you expect from this person? Eight of Pentacles. This person's going to work extra hard to get your attention. That Virgo energy, they want to build with you. They want to be with you. They want the Ten of Pentacles with you. I feel like you guys have blocked them out. Because you're in like your bubble here. What can this person expect from Capricorn? Judgment. You definitely will make a decision one way or the other. I feel you calling them on their bullshit. I feel like they've lived their life doing whatever with whoever, however they wanted to. Until you. Calling them on their bullshit. Scorpio energy. And you will make the decision about them. You're going to call it. I see it. Alright guys, so that's what I have for you. And I'll be speaking with you guys soon. Namaste.